This school year, you may have noticed something new when you accessed your Google Classrooms. You noticed that you had some provisioned classes, meaning that we have classes pre-created for you according to your sections in J Campus. These courses sync from Clever. Of course, J Campus talks to Clever and that information comes from there. So whatever is in J Campus, Clever took that information and created your sections for you here in Google Classroom. So based off what you have in J Campus, those are the courses you have here. You are not mandated or required to use those courses at all. You could create your own courses if you would like. This is what it looks like if a teacher has not accepted the courses. You can not accept them, you can archive them, you can do what you like, or you can create your own courses. But just keep in mind, it will save you a lot of time. We have the students preloaded in your classes already, so they don't have to add or join your class. And when students add or drop your classes, once it's updated in J Campus and Clever talks to J Campus, then the students will be removed from that class. Just as the same as when a student adds to your class. Once they're added in J Campus, then they will be added in the system in Google Classroom once it's finished speaking with Clever. So it does that automatic updating for you. You're not mandated to use the classes, but it is saving you time because your students are pre-uploaded. You have that information and as they add and drop, the system will update it of course, you have to wait. The waiting period could be 24, 48 to 72 hours for it to happen. Hopefully, most times it only takes the 24 hours or even quicker for it to happen. So if you notice those courses, we did create those courses for you based off of J Campus. And you can change the name of the courses. You're not stuck with those names. If you like to rename these courses, you definitely can. Right here, name these courses that you would like for your classes. So you do have the option to use it. We want to encourage you to use the provision classes that we have so that you don't have to check with adding and dropping students from the class. You will let the system do it so you don't have to worry about it and keep them in the class. So just keep that in mind for the provision classes. Don't be afraid. It's something that we did to help you guys out. It has your students already uploaded and it's based off of what's in J Campus. You can archive any that you would like you can use which ones you like, you can rename them, or you cannot use them at all. Those are your options, but we strongly encourage you to.